Meanwhile, so Snake King's back up again now as well. Strike coming through on a Toronto Tokyo. Snake King's back up. Time walk into the pit. They see that Roche is at about half health. And they've been throwing the alacrity on a skitter, but they've caught it. They're looking for the RP. No, they've already got the feature coming through on the face of Swoy. There's the RP on the two with the Wukong's command around them. Skitter snaking. They both died. They've got the buyback available on Skitter. They're going to look over as the face of Swoy. It's got to come back into the fight. They kill off nine. He's got buyback. Rose still Chrono up. Half health. They're not committing into it. They still have Chrono. And I believe they still have Cataclysm ready to go. So the Wombo combo is still available. Skitter time's off. Time walks into the pit. They've got the Bramble Maze down. And Skitter's just going to go for a Roach. Yutero looking. Skitter right click. Same. Mira shows him. Himself. Curse Crown on a skitter. They've got the primal spring right on these heroes as Curse Crown stuns up too, but they've got the hex on to Yatoro. They'll drop down the chrono. Do they have the catacombs? Yes, it's gonna come down. The nightmare! And all the nightmares saved from Maposhka! Maposhka saving Yatoro, but he's Yatoro still gonna survive. He's going back on a multiple heroes. They get the kill on Fada as well as nine. They'll take him too. They look over at Skitter and they will kill him off. 33. He can only just fight. It's a full team life for Team Spirit. They will dominate Tundra in this last fight. They will get the reward of Roche and it is an absolute clean fight from Team Spirit. Holy shit, speak up. These skills are- Everything for them. These skills are absolutely insane, and that save from Aposhka just completely wins them up. that fight, and I think the game here with this. Keeping your tour alive so he can get the bound and stuff for the life still, but collapse, man. These skewers are just unbelievable. These openings that he's finding over and over again. Absolute madman. And right through the tier two, they'll go onto the high ground. Nobody's got buyback here for Tundra. Divine Rapier now for Yatoro, knowing that he's got himself this Aegis. Look at these couriers. All these couriers go going out. They're going to go for the tier four as the couriers are probably trying to go get something, maybe even distract the side of Team Spirit. They've got the glyph, but they do not have Faceless Void for 60 seconds. Backdoor is up. up. Backdoor but... doesn't matter. Did you see the couriers on the Radiant side? They're actually trying to pull the Creep Wave away. But, yeah, not going to be enough, unfortunately. Yeah, they'll go for the throne in Spirit with a perfect fight by the Roche Pit. We'll take game one. That nightmare from Maposhka saves Yatro, the skewers, the RPs, all the control that came in from Spirit in that last fight, overwhelming. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, Spirit are, are going to take game one.